Hey now, everybody. I'm ExtraDemon27, and this is a video announcing the return of a old series of mine, Cornerstone. Except this time I'm doing a bit differently. Instead of it being a Let's Play series, I'm going to sort of make it a server that I build on, and I uh, do um, things with all my friends on here, and then I upload videos of the builds I do, build showcases, and also um, server events. So for this first video, I'd like to show you this uh, little build that I made. It's a small starter home, and whenever I'm starting out on servers like this, I really like making these small homes just an area to start out from. And one of the unique things about this build is the two different roof designs that it has. The bottom roof is a curved roof, and the top roof is a triangular roof. Now, there's two big things I really like to focus on when I'm making builds like this. The first one is detail, and uh, two big things that I did for the exterior of this area is um, I used a lot of fence gates. On the fence that goes around the crops down there, I used the fence gates to connect the little posts. And I also uh, used it for blinds in multiple areas. Now, uh, speaking of windows, all the windows on this house are basically different. I have checker patterns. I have just open scheme. I have different colored windowed panes in there. Always try and put detail into things. Just feel free to experiment when you're making builds like this. Just try and put a detail in there. See if it looks good. Get rid of it if you don't like it. Keep it there if you do. Now, the second thing is location. And I think I picked a pretty good area for this build. Now on the inside is where you really need to focus on detail. You're working with a very small area. So right here in this first room, I have an anvil, an area to put tools, storage on the top here, a functional fridge, and even a trash can, which is just a cactus uh, that's hidden by this painting on the sign on the sign. Then I have a fireplace right here. I can use this cauldron for cleaning um, dyed clothes and stuff, and then my furnaces are here. Now downstairs I have a basement and I don't really need to focus on lighting in here because uh, the floor is made out of slabs but it does have a functional light like here. Now one of the cool little details of this place is the wine thing that I have. These are little wine cases right here. I have a wine barrel here and that all accents this uh, brewing stand that I use. And this is my main storage area. Upstairs uh, is um, where I have my enchantment table and I also have a jukebox. Another big thing to focus on is lighting, and I have six areas of light in here. One on this side of the building, one on this side of the building, and another one on this side. Over here, I have a light in the ceiling up here, and then over here, I have the fire, and I'm using that for lighting. Up here, I have a painting, and that's hiding some glowstone right there. Upstairs in the corner here, again, I have the painting trick. There's a glowstone behind this little painting right here. And then over here, that lighting that was in the ceiling downstairs, that's this right here, and that shines right through the enchantment table. And then over here, we have a light behind this jukebox, and uh, that shines through, and that shines through the piston, and then through the flower and breaches here. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave it a like, and if you want to see more like it, subscribe, and I'll see you later.